In Illinois, schools can be open right now, but they have to have a plan in case of an outbreak. Monticello Community School District knows this all too well. Fox Illinois' Taylor Deckert shares how their transition is going. After having to switch to remote learning halfway through the semester, students are learning from home while teachers are still in the building. They are giving their lessons virtually in the classroom. Hold up your thumb. Keep track of how many points you get. The Monticello Community ah. School District has gone completely remote after a tough few weeks. Some students were fully so remote, some attending in person, and some students switching between the two due to contact tracing. It's like trying to teach kids on a merry-go-round, but you don't know which merry-go-round they're going to be on, so they whip past, and you're trying to give them some stuff, and then you're trying to figure out who's there. Andrew Webb now has a high school classroom all to himself, but he misses his students. The best part of teaching are the students and getting to know the students, interact with them, and make jokes with them. And so when you put them on a computer, like you lose that personal interaction, you lose that personal touch. Now that everyone is remote, it's like hitting a reset button. But it's much easier for us to keep track of the students and have everybody moving the same way at the same time. For kindergartners, this may be their first time in a classroom, but being remote has its perks. With them not having much of a preschool pre-COVID experience. It helps us because now we can take and build this experience for them and give them the best that we can do in our current circumstance. Being remote does cause its challenges. We we'll spend a lot of time learning to share and building peer relationships and those are things that um, my team and myself have had to get very creative and flexible and try to give them the same opportunities that they would have just in a different situation. Parents have a lot on their shoulders, but teachers say they're doing a great job. As they're arranging schedules around work and school and Zooms. I really wish that we were all here, all together again in class, but I think for right now this is the best thing we can do. And Mike, are you talking or do you have peanut butter in your mouth? Students will continue to great. learn remotely yeah, until December 7th. Additional guidance will be sent to families if there will be any changes between now and then. Reporting in Monticello, Taylor Deckert, back to you.